when you build formula you must build them in such a way that you can build them and they can be copied all the way across to the end and try and avoid have situations where you've built a formula so you'll see we've built a formula but then if we go down here where the months change into annual you'll see that we've got a different formula so you can see those two formula are vastly different there are two problems with this firstly it makes it, it gives you a little bit more work when you're trying to review if everything's okay so for example I'd look at that formula and then I know that I have to look here and check that that formula is correct if you make use of a spreadsheet auditing software you'll see here this is telling us that there's a formula in column F22 so you'll see over here F22 and the software then highlights that there's another formula over here so we now need to check both those formulas to make sure they're correct they're in the correct period etc as opposed to if I built a proper formula you'll see this formula checks to see if we're in the correct month but that formula is copied all the way across so although it's slightly more complex when you look at the auditing software you'll see there's a formula copied all the way across that means that as long as we're happy that that formula is correct we're now happy with that whole row another common problem is if you're under severe time pressure and you realize for example that this here shouldn't be using the including that but the excluding that you may correct it and with enough time pressure you'll copy it and you'll just go like that and paste it without thinking and suddenly you've overwritten your other formula so you'll see the answers are vastly different and incorrect this is a problem even if you try and address it by using colors so for example here in the next sheet you'll see I've got a formula if I go to the right I've actually color coded it so I can kind of see that this formula now changes and again you can see it's incorrect it's using a hard coded number and then if I go a little bit further I've changed the color again that's fine but again the problem is if the model's big enough you'll see a problem here make the correction and if you're under enough time pressure you'll copy and paste the whole way so rather build a formula that addresses all your needs and if we look at the auditing software again with this version we can see there's a formula copied all the way across a new formula copied across a new formula copied across versus one formula copied all the way across so if we were reviewing or auditing this model here we have to look at three formulas and assess them here we have to look at one so it's a significant time saving and it is significantly safer to build a single formula that you can copy all the way across